Hi. Uh, the seasons, they are a changing, so it would seem. So uh, today we are going to talk about uh, making your home a little cosy for the autumn winter period. And we're going to do that without talking about pumpkins, Connecticut or anything orange. OK, <laughs> that's as simple as that. We are just going to give you some tips. I find that easier than rambling on about it. I'm going to give you some tips on how to cosy up your home for this autumn winter period. If you like this video, please do like and subscribe. Number one. OK, um, I suggest you dress your house like you would dress yourself for winter time. Layer it up. If you have a hardwood floor or a tiled floor or even a carpet, you can layer some rugs on top of any sort of a floor, really. It will instantly change the look of the room. It will change the colour of the room and it will make it cosier. You need to trust me on this. It really, really will. Now, I have a whole blog, I think, on my website, denisesmithdesigns.com, uh, dealing with how to choose rugs and how to put rugs down and all that sort of stuff. So feel free to check that out. That's all free on the website. Uh, so have a little look at that. But just layer your flooring, OK? Number two, add some mirrors. Not only will it increase the size of your room, but it will also increase the light. And as light is in such short supply, particularly natural light, obviously, uh, during the autumn and winter, it will add extra light to your home. And there's nothing better than some natural light for anyone, trust me. So just add some mirrors and instantly add some light to your home. Number three, add some candles, lots and lots of candles. Um, what you can do is, uh, obviously, oh, lots of tea lights. We've all got thousands of tea lights somewhere in a cupboard. Uh, tea lights are fine, but I particularly like large candles, but I always put them in glass vases because, first of all, it makes it, it they look nicer when they're actually in, in glass and they reflect and it gives a lovely atmosphere to a room. But I would suggest you get lots of white candles. They have relatively inexpensive candles in Ikea. Have a look there. You can buy dozens of them for a few euro. And if you have some, even jam jars, seriously, just drop some candles and some jam jars, all sorts of things. And it will transform the room as the room darkens. You have these beautiful, uh, almost like fairy lights, I suppose, everywhere. They are quite beautiful. So just add some candles to make your home feel a little cosier on these long evenings. Number four. Start layering in your bedroom. Lots of throws, lots of different colour throws. Now, if your bed linen is white, as I have suggested before, you can change not only the look of your bedroom, <laughs> the look of your bed and your bedroom, uh, with some throws. It will add extra heat, it will make it look softer and it will be warmer, I promise you. So just try uh, some throws and bits and pieces. They have some beautiful throws in Ikea. They've got some in Dunn Stores. Dunn Stores are some really nice stuff, actually. You should have a look at their uh, home section there. Paul Costello does some great stuff. Uh, it's not as cheap as the rest of Dunn Stores, but they do some really, really nice stuff. Uh, have a look there. Uh, I'm trying to think of anywhere else that would be. Debenhams have some, and so do Marks and Spencers. But seriously, Ikea have a wonderful selection and it's really inexpensive. So have a little look there, okay? Uh... Uh, number 
that. <laughs> add some greenery. You can add uh, some potted plants, which I have, and I've also got some orchids, which last for a lifetime, as I've told you about endlessly before. Um, but you can also just add some flowers. You'll be amazed. Actually, I might do a video on just adding some flowers, some very simple flowers, because I don't do anything complicated, as you know. Um, just add some flowers. Okay, or some potted plants. It will just spruce the place up and it will clear the air as well. There's something really lovely about having some plants in your home. Okay, that's it for this week. I hope we've helped you in some way to cosy up your home without using a pumpkin for the autumn winter time. Um, if you've enjoyed this video, please do like and subscribe and I will see you next time. Cheerio. Bye bye.